man. Do you even know what a fucking Q is? Anyway, let's just get this thing started. <clears throat> Welcome to another edition of Sewer Gators. I'm your host, Pete Walken. Tonight, we take you to Dolby, Louisiana. Let's just roll the fucking tape. We take you to the Baker home. A place where we'll find a Lucas Baker. This guy's a real nut job. Known for making all sorts of weird devices and crazy toys. And we're getting reports that this guy's got some sort of connection to a secret organization that has some ties to bioterror or something. Everybody wants the turf. So pay attention. Because it's life or death. <laughs> You, my friend, you are one lucky son of a bitch. This joy? Well, you can't fake this. Don't be like that. It's gonna be fun. Just you wait. Uh, 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 uh. Happy birthday. Is it ready? Can we begin? If you want to know more, pick up not a hero. Are we doing fucking commercials now, guys? Come on, we can do better than this. What's up guys, the Super AJS here. We got some trailers for the new Resident Evil 7 coming out. And it, this, we got three volumes. First one's about Lucas Baker. This is the one about Lucas Baker. We finally find out what happens to Lucas. Well, not what happens, but we find out he's still around. The spoiler alert at the end of Resident Evil 7, he just runs out of the room he was in during his little game in the main campaign. So we know that he's around and that the new Not A Hero DLC is going to be about that. Chris Redfield chasing Lucas, wherever it is he may be. We don't know yet. And it's presented in the, the way the trailer starts. It's presented in the way of Sewer Gators, uh, the show from the main campaign. They, they, it's just, it shows Pete, the host, who was in the game, the one that talked a lot of shit. Uh, he's he's there like sitting down like oh hey it's sewer gators today's episode is blah 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 and they talk about Lucas Baker and then he's like let's put in the tape and he puts in the tape and they the trailer plays as if it's the tape that's really cool I really like that I I really like the the way they're promoting the gold edition of Resident Evil Seven for for those of you who haven't played Resident Evil Seven go play it it's awesome or just wait for the gold edition it comes with all the DLC I got the season pass so I got the band footage one and two I. We kind of want to do a let's play on those. I'll get to those eventually. But yeah, I'm definitely going to do one on uh, um, the end of Zoe. The new DLC is coming out. And along with the Not a Hero, which is free, you have to buy End of Zoe. I don't know if it's in the season pass. I, I really hope so. I really hate to buy this if I have a season pass. But anyway, but uh, yeah, I'm really excited for it. Put your thoughts and comments down below. What you think of what you thought about the Resident Evil Seven, and are you excited for Not a Hero and the End of Zero E DLC? I am. I really want to kill Lucas. I really do. I hated his ass. He was so annoying. Er. But all right, guys. As always, thank you so much for watching. Like, subscribe, comment. We shall see you in the next video. Have a good one. Go play Resident Evil Seven. It's a hell of a lot better than Five. We'll see you.